Okay, welcome back everybody to my Hasty Bot series. It's been a while. Um, current record is 18 to 14 in my favor. We're playing two games. You know the drill. Alright, let's start things off. Alright, play a computer. Classic, there we go. Alright, let's see what happens. So we're first, very nice. Um, I see laptop on my rack. That's probably the right play. We'll play right here. Um, yeah, I think this is this is the play. There's a funny word in the North, uh, the British lexicon, international lexicon, a poop, but uh, it's not playable here. So, yeah, I think laptop is the right idea here. All right, uh, we draw two S's and a, and a Z. That's really nice. Uh, I can play closes. It's the first thing I see. There might be some bingo here. I don't think so, though. Yeah, I think it's just closes. In terms of, like, any other alternate plays, I, yeah. I can't really see anything that I would consider other than what I'm about to make. Just does really nice things to the board. I take a almost 50 point lead and keep an S. Yeah, it's very hard to imagine something better than this. So let's go. So your knight comes down. That's a bingo for hasty. Uh, so we're actually behind now. Could do something like who. That's the first thing that comes to mind. It's not great to leave myself with a U. Uh, it's also not great to leave myself with uh, bingo tiles, one point tiles, um, with a board like this where the only spot is really through the URA. That could very well just be blocked next turn with a play from the age column, which would only give me one spot to bingo on the first row. Um, Uso is actually a word as well, but it's not worth spending the S for that. So in terms of other alternate plays here, I think there's something like Wino, which takes away the H1 spot, leaves the U, but it leaves the H. So the H can uh, be very helpful when you have a U on your rack. Um, you can get rid of it in, in a variety of different ways, uh, just with UH, for example. Um, so I think Wino looks pretty good. Um, yeah, I like it a lot more than Who. But there might be something I'm missing here. Nowish is that even a word? It doesn't matter. Luckily, uh, yeah, I obviously would like to have something that gets rid of the U. I don't think there really is anything here. Yeah. Okay, so I think I'm going to go with Wino. I'm actually taking the lead with that play, so it's not actually that terrible. Yeah, all right, let's do Wino. So Thad comes down. Luckily, we have our H, so we can play Hurdies here. Um, Hurdies is only valid with the IES. Uh, it's not valid with just a Y. Actually, in a recent tournament I just played, somebody got away with Hurdy with just the Y at Hurdies. I think it's a type of clothing and uh, only valid plurally. Plurally. Yeah, I don't see anything that could even be remotely as good as this. So let's go. All right, Mincers comes down. We draw the last two S's, um, which is cool. Mincers, that's actually pretty good for hasty because there are two blanks out. So um, it's pretty likely to have drawn one or both at this point. But who knows? Still only halfway done with the game. So nothing to really infer from that. 
So yeah, something like Ivy somewhere would be nice, but the only spot I see to play Ivy is quite dangerous. Here or here. Either way, not a huge fan. Giving back triples for almost nothing. Um, I could also play Viney, which I saw, but that does actually take the sneaky L hook of Vinyl. So um, that's that's a hook that often gets overlooked because it's just totally random. If you think Viney, the word is done, but you can just add an L to it. Um, savory. Veracity. Bastatory. Yeah, what else could I do? I guess I could keep the Y. I really do want to get rid of the V though. Vistal, not a word. Hmm. Not coming up with much here. I can just play Tivy. Again, I'm just not scoring anything. Why am I not scoring anything? Vastity. Play T. This T hook on oft is not like great. And I could play Saste. 33. Not a horrible play, but I don't think it's right. Get rid of both my S's. Create a huge S spot. And keep a V. Of all things. I'll just drop an S. 19, but that doesn't help either. Sylvite. Hmm. Again, like, there's just nothing that I see in this position. Nothing that I like. I want to accomplish something. If I can't make a good play that's like that scores well and keeps well, I want to accomplish something. So what is there to accomplish here? Uh, I could maybe try to block the L and M columns. Something like that. But that allows ticks plays. Play that here. I get hurt with the X. I'm not up by that much that I want to endure that. Oh, I feel like there's just something, there's something here and I'm missing it. Vita. All right, well, I guess I can just be really aggressive and play Ivy. Yeah. Nasty. Taking forever on this turn. Yeah, sometimes there's just nothing that jumps out to you. Do have 23 vowels, 29 constants. I could also add the T on, make it a little bit difficult, more difficult to play from the end column down. Yeah, maybe. Or maybe I do Vita here. Yeah, it looks fine. Vita here doesn't actually give like really anything back shuts down the lane okay i'm doing vita exchange six wow that is very fortunate um we still have our y which means we have somewhat of a vowel here uh, i could do something like horsey do give the y back but that's fine Already some weird lanes open for like from the W. This Borsch. I think that 
Yeah, it's not good without the C. B O R S C H. There's a spelling of Borscht. Yeah, there's a funny play here of Burr. Um, it's funny because I laughed. But I think Horsey has got to be better. Scores more, better leave. X is not a word. Yeah, okay. Doing horsey. Don't bring it to the Y, please. Don't be mean. All right, Tobbs is great. Shuts down the Y. ATT doesn't take an S. Um, but still two blanks out. We're up with Bingo. I think I'm just going to go with Brawl here. That scores super well. Yeah, I think for all, that's what we're doing. Can't really, still I can't really address the W without sacrificing too much. So for all it is. The ox comes down for 25 and we draw extremely well. So this looking very good. Uh, I just need to find a bingo here. I have Senegas here. It's 76. Uh, if there's something with the W, that'd be better. Might not be, though. Wageness. Wageless is good, I think. And there could be, like, something here, like, sensorage. Hit both doubles. Or even here. Hmm. That looks a bit more promising. Sorry, I've been out of frame this whole time. I really need to adjust my uh, my setup so that I'm in frame a bit more. Um, just yeah, I just changed my setup at home, so apologies if I'm like this the whole time. That's where I'm looking. Um, a Genesis. All right, I'm just going to play Senegas. Should win regardless. It's really hard to imagine two bingos from Hasty on this board. Keg comes down, we draw the other blank. Okay, so we'll just do whatever. Um, beauty. Just do Nutsy if I wanted to. Um, maybe play Buy somewhere. Really doesn't matter. Be aggressive about it. Left wing is played. And uh, we're going to play Aeonian or Aeolian, I guess. It's a unlikely bingo. It's a very low probability one. It's pretty cool. All right. Um, Metanoia, Aeonian, Aeolian. Anorexia. Just trying to go through all those. Five vowel, eight letter words. Make sure I'm not missing one. I don't know where it would be. Aeonian. Doesn't really matter where I put the blank. It'll score the same. All right, doing this, emptying the bag. Let's see if we draw the Q. 50 50. Did not draw it. Okay. what to do. I guess we can try to solve this endgame. M-E-R-E. -E. Is there an outplay? I don't see an outplay for hasty. Merg. L-E not valid. That helps. Emir from an E. So how do we go out in two? I 
gonna be difficult to go out and take them. Um, can do O O E. What am I doing with that? Don't think I'm going out to. Just do something. Diode. He comes down, of course. I gave that to hasty. And uh, doesn't matter. Okay. Four sixty one to three fifty three was the game. Anything could have happened there. I mean I was up I was up pretty um pretty significantly, but Hasty could have drawn both flanks and bring it twice. It would have been pretty close. Alright, let's go again. Um oh this is good. We have remains. Um Melon no, Endemial is the one with the L. Melanide is the one that you come up with first and realize if you've studied enough that that's incorrect. Melanite is a word. Melanoid is a word. Friedman, do I have a seven letter word? I don't think so. Does it make you a B? No. So I think it'll be endemial. I think I have to I have to open a triple. Um obviously endemial is the more dangerous triple. Opening opening this E and remained for nine less opening the D. So I have to take the points. Is there another is there an anagram to remain though? Hmm. Alright, endemial it is. So fiat, that's really not the worst thing that could happen. Only forty points. AC's average score is probably around 50 something or so after Endemial, so happy about that. Though we do have this potential triple triple open. I have like almost stuff like Profer, Poofery. Pretty sure it's not good. Uh, almost irony here. Can't overlap this T E. So she doesn't seem like I can do so much here. Uh, could do Fayer. Really not ideal keeping double O M P. Could do Boomy for a much better leave, but nine fewer points. PER is very nice and I actually can draw into some triple triples. And I'm not super ahead here. I think Boomy is fine. Uh, I already put it there. I think Boomy is, is better than Bayer. Just for the leave. Like PER is a very good leave. Roomy. Yeah, I'm just seeing if there's some word I'm missing here. I don't think so. Did look earlier. All right, let's try Boomy. Be a little bit aggressive. Score is close. Game is early. Vexing comes down, and wow. If you see it, you see it. If you draw it, you draw it. Overpaid for 185, and that is going to propel us to a very likely victory, being up 165 points in this game. Okie doke. So, I guess we can try to block some lanes here, keep decent stuff that has some synergy to it. Uh, how does one start here? This rack isn't fantastic. I could just do verb. I could have some really cool over B word, like overbuying. Come down, CIST. 
is pretty good. He can respond well to potential things hasty does. Um, this lane can't really... I can try to deal with that lane, I guess. But what's great about Verb is it blocks the double-double from the M and the triple to the E, which are the two big threats in the position. So I do like Verb a lot. It's kind of trivial as well. So I'm going to win pretty much no matter what I do, as long as I make decent plays. Okay, so Verb comes down, Gian comes down, Gian does not take an S in the North American Lexicon, so I don't have to worry that did my job for me of blocking the B column. Um, but I actually might reopen the 15 row here with chip. It's just so many points. Oh, wait. That would be a big mistake. Why was I thinking CEM? Guess I could just do hemp. Yeah, just REM here and HEM. I guess I could do HIP. But yeah, I could see myself losing potentially after this. So maybe just be a little bit more shy. Hemp keeps the vowel, doesn't open anything. It blocks this A, which is significant. Let's do this. Ag. So yeah, Hasty plays off one tile. Uh, just demonstrating how solid the grip on this board is here. Um, I like to do like something. This would be so good if the A was an E. Um, obviously here, the verbs lane is something to keep my eye out for. Um, I do have an S myself. There are two other S's on the scene. So I could just do... Twenty-four vowels means a constant, so I think I should get rid of my eye now. It's been nice keeping a vowel pretty likely to redraw in here. Keeping the C to maybe restrict the board later. I can't really do much about verbs here unless I want to play like is, but then I could get into trouble if something's played from the R or something. Um centrist. Just go for points with arcs. Don't want to keep tint. Again, it's pretty. It doesn't really matter. Let's see if Hasty even has a blank or ness with its fish. Uh, I probably actually want to keep CRT, so I'll do stains here. CRT is better than CNT. Let's do this. A doze. A hasty draw. Maybe hasty drew that Z. That's funny. We've drawn a blank, of course, as it's been for these past two games, drawing very, very well. Um, I don't see a bingo. I see a lot of eight letter words. Instruct or to contest a turn. Now I have cutier. I maybe want to try and get over buying here. I think I'm just going to play Uteri. Maybe we'll get another triple triple. Yeah, I might have a bingo and I don't care. I guess I do care. But... Don't see it. Okay, Scunner comes down. So. What do we have? Corotate doesn't, I mean, Corotate fits to the E of Scunner. 
I don't want to open a triple triple here, obviously. I'm just looking through those ends. A C N L O T T. There's no like cartoon. Okay. Hmm. Again, I'm out of frame. Sorry again. <laughs> really gonna fix that for next. For next video, octantal, octo, all right, I'm just going to play co-rotate, we've done it, Tushing comes down, Hasty is actually down only 42 points. This is the uh, exact scenario Hasty needed. Well, minus me getting one of the bingos. So I have to be a bit careful here. Unseen letters aren't formidable. Um, I want to maybe play Wode or Wadi somewhere. Okay, um, probably just Wadi. I almost have stuff here. I don't see it quite fitting. Yeah, scores well, I guess blocks the N. Gets rid of some of the bad stuff. Um, I do want to deal with this bottom of the board situation. There is only one IN combo left, or two IN combos, but only one N. Yeah, I think I can outrun pretty much everything here. Hasty bingos immediately, it's drawing seven, so I'll have a very nice end game. Okay, Nelly comes down, which is unfortunate for Hasty, I think. Although actually, yeah, I don't really want to play this Y, but I can play Oak. Okay, I mean, not to empty the bag, go up by 77. I should outrun, again, I should outrun pretty much anything. Uh, Yeah, it's funny, this is getting like too close for comfort. Let's see what happens. Okay, winery comes down, no bingo. That's too bad, that would have been interesting. Hasty did bingo. It just, just goes to show, you can't really let your guard down even when you triple triple for 200 early in the game. Um, Guess I can just do something here. Can I do something here? Actually, I don't think I can. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Right, whatever, I can just do whatever I want. Play Tafia. Hasty has LEU after Tafia. The rule. All right, I don't, I mean, how much is Faina? Same as Tafia, probably something better, a field. Okay, 500 to 441. Now we are up to 20 to 14. Another two wins in a row. We're on, I think, a six game winning streak here. So hopefully it continues. Um, let's examine these games. Let's see if there are any improvements. Laptop looks good. 
closes, yeah. Okay, Zeus is interesting. I should have just considered that. The equity is a lot lower. You can see the number here. She scores a lot less. But with having another S and this sort of blocking a lot of options, you could very much see this and instead if you want to be aggressive early on. And it closes still fine. Although Zeus would have... I think Zeus would have blocked everything. That hasty head there. Wow. Oh. All right. Oh, and no how. Yeah, I did feel like I was missing something. I saw who so, but not know how. That is 36 points. Likely to be at least close. I'm going to start simming that position to see. Know how versus why no versus who. I guess there was the option as well of playing who here to set up an S hook. I'll leave that in the sim as well. And I'll start running that to see what the engine thinks. Um, is it bad? It's played and hurties. Yeah, perfect. Insers keeps another M. Makes sense. Yeah, like these options all kind of suck. Vasty also kind of sucks. So opening the double double. The word starting an S or E. Yes, I have the last S's, but probably a bit too aggressive. I don't know. I think it's a bit too aggressive. I could play Vasti here, though. There are no C's unseen. Although, that's the same problem. You could just see a, bing a blank C bingo at some point. So I think Vita is fine. The absence of decent options here. Stay, yeah, maybe stay is okay. I really wanted to get rid of my B. B is useless. All right. Exchange seven. So I think Casey would have played mix or mixed if I hadn't played there, which would have been pretty good for me anyway. But it would have scored scored points, so whatever. Horsey goes, looks good. Brawl looks good. Wangies. Ah. Did not think of that. That is nice. That is a miss. Um, if it mattered more, that would have been pretty bad. Still pretty bad to miss. But yeah. Wangies. Util is fine. Left wing. Aeolian. Yeah. It's pretty trivial. Okay. Now let's look at this other game. See if we missed anything significant. Um, Blair, yeah, Demula remained, Yacht, oh, Miney, okay, that was the play to the, to the Ion that I was not thinking of. I imagine that Boomy is still better, just based on the, what the board looks like here. I guess Miney does block some scoring, though. I'll take a look at that on the... On, on the simulation here too. Uh, so far, let's take a look. Let's go to this. There we go. Yeah, so far Wino's doing pretty well just because it slows down a lot of scoring it's from last game. But yeah, know how is definitely something to consider, um, which I didn't. Yeah, it seems like they're pretty close. All right, let's go back to this. And let's export this game and start simulating the Miney versus Boomy position. All right. And I'll put Fair in there, even though I'm almost certain my analysis was pretty good that Fair was definitely not worth points. I mean, Miney has to be better than Fair. does the same things. Does the same, same thing as scores points and keeps a better lead, so I don't know why. I'm, yeah, I'm not going to put Fair in there, actually. 
Okay, let's let that run for a bit. Oops. Vexing, yeah, I mean, Hasty didn't do anything wrong. Sometimes that's how it go. Um, QIS, verb looks nice. There are no good plays, so do something, accomplish something. Gian. Oh, Hick. Hick only takes a K hook, which I, I don't have, so it's just going to stay there maybe for a bit. But it seems pretty safe. I think Hemp is fine. Makes a bit more sense. Uh, just act to keep an eye on RT. Yeah, that could, that could have been better maybe to respond to bingos, but keeping the C can be useful if Hasty makes a play that maybe opens a part of the board and isn't a bingo. The C can be very useful to shut that down. Strict, I guess, is also possible just to play a lot of tiles, maybe go for a blank and score points. Strict like, makes a lot of sense as well. Yeah, I was happy with stains, leave everything as is. The doze comes down, and yeah, he, he did draw the uh, Z on the one tile draw there. That's funny. Uh, yeah, Eureka, or Uteri, doesn't really matter. There were no bingos. Scunner and Corotate only bingo. And touching, and suddenly, yeah, there's only a 42. And I can't really address the bottom part of the board here. I don't really have any overlaps. And anything I do is probably going to open stuff. Except, actually, I could have played in Dow. Didn't consider that. There are no S's left. That really restricts very well and also deals with the end as well. That could have been the option, but... We'll lose more often when HC does bingo. We'll, we'll block enough bingos to which it's probably worth doing. Because I can lose after either of these plays. Uh, and yeah, Nelly comes down and, okay, Callion. Yeah, here, I mean, if I had, if I really needed to in a tournament, I would go through all the bingos that I could find, like Train Full, for example. Um, Funereal, I saw. Uh, if Howline doesn't fit, unfairly, unfairly, very much could have won the game, actually. I'll take a look at that in Quackle right after this. Um, but okay, going up by a ton of points and just trying to outrun everything. Makes sense. All right, so let's take a look at analysis here. Um, and wow, yeah, my camera. <laughs> Let me come into frame here, and yeah, my play is slightly better according to Quackle, but it's very, very close, even closer than the last one. So definitely should have considered Miney against a human opponent. Um, there's potentially a little bit more value or a little bit less value, depending on the human does, <laughs> uh, to playing Miney, uh, leaving, not leaving the triple-triple open. So if you're playing a human opponent that's really good at making targeted attempts to hit stuff on the triple triple there's a slight advantage to just not letting that happen but you can do the same thing yourself and that's what i was kind of doing with boomy um because my average score after boomy is 50 points that's probably because i draw into a decent amount of um decent amount of uh triple triples as well as bingos with per uh, but against a computer like Hastybot, it's not going to do anything like target its leave to try and hit this FE triple triple. Anyways, um, yeah, if we go back or go all the way to the Wadi turn, I can take a look at um, something like Indow versus Wadi to see if Quackle provides with anything. Um, noteworthy says after endow opponent bingos yeah half as much as wadi we'll have to wait and see um, as it runs a bit longer that's pretty significant um, and yeah I can't really ever I mean I possible but next turn I can't really deal with the higher scoring bingos on the bottom row or rows either and so having a play to do that now is pretty good um, both plays use four tiles, um, which 
is ideal, I think, in this situation. Um, but yeah, it's looking wadi more because I guess I'm just able to outscore a bit more with ADO. And I don't really know why. I guess I myself draw into more stuff at the end of the game immediately. Yeah, it's a pretty big difference. I don't know, I might have done in Dao and do over. But you have to play very precisely after in Dao to make sure you're not going to lose. And so here, uh, if I put in all the unseen letters at once, let's see the biggest threats unlikely, which unwarily and unfairly, those are very big threats. Yeah, there are a lot of them. It's only uh, three tiles in the bag. There are a lot of available bingos, but don't be fooled. Um, if I put in uh, play them thinking of making, it will definitely say that Hasty is bingoing like less than 10% of the time. Um, no matter what I do. But these are things to, to be worried about. So the fact that stuff to the Y is potentially enough to win. Um, if I play Callion uh, and then put in uh, D-O-E, my lead, A-E-F-I-L-N-R-E-W, um, unwarily still plays, wow. Yeah, this is going to win, this is going to win, actually any bingo. I'm giving eight points back. Yeah, any bingo here is going to win, except Funereal. Um, but there are fewer of them. So Funereal... Oh no, Funereal wins too. Okay, I just miscalculated. Yeah, yeah, I'm only up 77. So Kalyan loses immediately to bingos. Um, whereas I probably win sometimes, even if Hasty has like the worst stuff. So, I mean, unwifely, if we look at this, um, Hasty's drawing one tile. Uh, I have the D though. Um, yeah. What I have. So with this rack, I yeah, I'm just gonna lose. I think after. Yeah. I yeah, I can't win after unwifely. I can't win. I'm not drawing any enough scoring, scoring stuff. I'm not drawing any bingos. Um, so yeah, unwifely will always beat me because uh, Hasty will draw next turn. Uh, but maybe something like unfairly, I can still survive um, potentially. It looks really difficult. Yeah, even area is not enough. Yeah, any anything anything to the Y looks really devastating actually. Like unwarily, I don't think there's a big difference there. Area still loses. Draw the F. The field still loses. Um yeah. Yeah, that's pretty telling. Um so there's three bingos that win after okay. At the very least, but something like trainful, I can probably survive. Um, but it has trainful, it has unfairly, so I'm not gonna play trainful. Let's try something like what was it, free will? I think this is oh, okay, I can win after free will. Oh, sorry, it was playing free will up here, wasn't it? The other placement is, yeah. Um, just barely losing this. Anyways, this just goes to show leaving one in the bag, you can sometimes steal games. Yeah, Nyad is. So yeah, I sometimes went after free will. Anyways, all that's is to say that uh, I could have lost. After all that, I could have lost. Sorry for not being in frame. Let's remove this for next time. Um, that was my games against Hasty today, uh, 20, 2014. It's pretty good. I have another 16 to go in my series, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.